what's up you guys today i decided to go do some lonely shopping i want to film a haul video and yesterday i actually went thrift shopping but it wasn't successful so today i decided to continue the little journey but i'm riding solo because my boo thing is at work and i just thought i would take you all along so let's go to ross Five bucks at Walmart. All right, guys, I am back and I just finished with my little shopping spree. I spent a little more than anticipated, but it's okay because it's closed and they're necessary right anyways um yeah i was in there for about an hour i think an hour or so a little more than an hour i tried on so many clothes but it was a very chill day and there wasn't that many people so the line also at checkout wasn't that bad but I am gonna get some food now and I will see you guys when I get home so I can show you what I got. I'm finally home. I mean, I've been home for a while. <laughs> I've been home for a while. I got myself some food. I ate, I watched some friends and now I'm ready to show you all what I got. This was my, this was my journey. Since last week, I've been wanting to go thrift shopping and I told my boyfriend I told Jerry, let's go thrift shopping. Let's. Uh, my intentions were to waste more or less 20 bucks on some thrift items because I have found a lot of good things for two dollars, a dollar. Sometimes with the with the discounts that they have already in stores, I could probably get them cheaper. So that was my intention, but it wasn't in my cards to find good things this time. So. I did what any other woman would do and I went to Ross. Now, of course Ross is not as inexpensive as a thrift store, but I found really good items there and they had plenty this time around. I'm going to show you all what I got. It's not much what I bought, but it was quite a few. So I started off looking for jeans. I really wanted to find a good pair of jeans. I don't like shopping in general. I hate shopping for jeans. That's why I usually buy the same brand online. I already know my size. I already know what types of what type of material I like, so I don't even stress about it. But I thought, hey, last time that I went shopping at Ross, I actually found a really good pair of jeans, which were the ones that I was wearing today. They're high-waisted, they're nice, simple blue jeans but I didn't have any luck this time it wasn't the best week for shopping I guess but it's okay the first thing that I did find that I really needed actually are some slacks for work I've been putting it off for forever since I started this new job and it was time girl it was time to go shopping for some slacks they're just regular black slacks just you know very simple it's actually a really good material the waistband is stretchy it does not have any buttons in the front it has pockets which is extremely hard to find in slacks it does not have the pockets in the back these are oh sorry I just slipped you off these are faux pockets here in the back they are the brand NYCC, New York Clothing Company. They fit well. They are long and they're perfect for work. 
next item as i was looking for those slacks and possibly some other types of bottoms i actually came across these really really cute i think they're like sweats but kind of like joggers uh, type of pants and they are ralph lauren so i really like these because of the little details as you can see it has this suede string right here with some gold detailing i'm not the best at describing stuff so don't mind me but i'm gonna try my best i really like them they're super comfy of course stretchy and it has that same suede ribbon all along the side of the pants and the bottom is like this i tried them on they're very comfortable perfect for a casual day at home which is me all the time <laughs> which is why i got them next i don't know if i specified in the beginning that these items that i'm showing you first i did get at ross so let me continue i actually tried on a whole bunch of jeans i tried on seven pairs of jeans and i'm the type of person that if even if they look good i'm not gonna wear them if they don't feel good so I'm not even gonna deal with that. I just said, no thanks, not today. I'm really sad that I wasn't 100% convinced because they were really cute. I went straight for the t-shirts and this is what I got. I found this one first and I loved it because it reminded me of my childhood and I think it's just adorable. It's It's Tom and Jerry, oh my gosh it's tom and jerry i used to love watching the same movie over and over and over and over again of tom and jerry i don't remember if there's a, a specific name for that movie but it is so cute and i love it and i used to watch it all the time as a kid and that is why i got this t-shirt now all these t-shirts are actually kind of cropped such as this one but they're not like the short type of crop which i like because I don't like shirts that are too long and I don't like shirts that are too short. So I think this is just the perfect length. Next one, I got this one right here. This says Polaroid. It's the camera for a whole new generation, land camera. I really like this one because it has that like rustic look to it. I don't know how to describe it exactly. And then it has, I don't know, is this Japanese? and it has these like colorful little lines on it so i also loved it because of that last but not least clothing item i got this very cool very beachy vibes i feel like i get <laughs> reggae kind of hippie looking shirt and it says take it sleazy on it and it has these palm trees a cactus plant a little trailita on it i don't know so you can camp out in it and it's really cool right so like i said these are crops but they are wide and they are i mean i did get them a little oversized because i just like that oversized feel and they're not too short but they're so cute and that is the last clothing item that i got I did also buy a candle and it's this Island Palm candle by Ivy Botanics Candle Company. This one right here, super, super pretty. And it smells awesome. As soon as I'm done with this video, I'm gonna light this thing up and just take a nap probably because it's so calming and so relaxing. It smells fresh, it smells like flowers oh it actually says on the on the lid itself um, palm fronds palm fronds with accents of tropical pineapple papaya and creamy coconut so I guess not flowers but I don't know it smells really really good you can see it there from the thrift store I went to I think it's just a local thrift store it's called Texas thrift so it's only in Texas but I'm not sure if only here in the valley 
It's the only big thrift store that I found that has a lot of variety for actual thrift prices, which I truly, truly love. I only got two shirts from there um, this time around, but last time I got, I'm going to say about seven tops. I was actually going to wear uh, one of these today, but then I thought, nah, because I wanted to show you for the video, not worn. I just got this plain t-shirt with a little pocket it's an olive color it's in perfect condition I think it's new actually it does not have any ribs it does it doesn't feel like it's been used or even washed I mean I'm definitely gonna wash it I haven't washed these items yet but it doesn't feel like it has been though I love t-shirts I don't know it's just easy to wear it's uh, it always looks good and it goes with literally anything. You can wear it with jeans, you can wear it with sweats, you can wear it with a skirt, you can wear it with shorts, you can wear it with leggings. Last item of the day. I was kind of iffy about getting this shirt. It was $4, not because it was $4, but I just feel like yellow is not my color. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys right now. This shirt also doesn't feel like it's been used or washed, which is why I was convinced. It's perfect for the summer. It has all these little cute flowers on it. It has a pretty pattern. It's fresh, it's yellow, it's bright, and I need to wash that one too. All right, you guys, that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate everyone who has been liking, who has been commenting, who has been replying to my insta stories or my snap stories or even just commenting on my screenshots of the video on facebook or anywhere i really appreciate you guys i love that some of you all are really enjoying these videos i'm having a lot of fun <laughs> filming them and it just makes me feel so good knowing that you know people that i know <laughs> in, in real life people that I know in person are watching me on a screen and probably to a lot of you guys y'all haven't seen me since like high school it's a good way to kind of communicate I love knowing what people are up to and this is just a way to show the world what I'm up to and it's really fun I mean if y'all have any suggestions on what types of videos you might want to see for me I know my cousin Jessica I love you Jess, you are the best. You are so encouraging and I freaking love you for that. <laughs> you always message me when I post something or I don't know, you watch something that you liked, but thank you for that girl, you the bomb. She suggested some video ideas that she wants to watch. So it'd be awesome if more of you guys suggested some types of videos that you would wanna see from me. I can bring Jerry on here more. I've actually been wanting to film a video with my older brother. I think it would be funny. So maybe I'll make a video with him. He actually suggested we try some ghost peppers or he suggested that I try some ghost peppers for a video. And I told him I would only do it if he did it with me. But I don't know how I feel about a ghost pepper, so. That is it for today. Thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to like this video, leave a comment down below, turn on your post notifications, and of course subscribe so you guys can stay updated on this growing channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Oh yeah.